Hi students, in last class we have we are discussing about percentages in profit and loss. In that we have seen how to find profit percentage and loss percentage. We didn't see how to find cost price and selling price. Have we learned these two formulas? How to find cost price and selling price? If we have profit percentage and loss percentage. So let's see how we use these formulas. The formulas manam ela use them. How we represent these formulas? Okay. So very simple formula, but we require calculation part mainly here. So let's see some questions. We have the some important questions here. So let's see. So by selling an article for rupees 660, a man gains 10%, then find cost price of the article. So what they have given, Nana? First of all, we need to write the given data properly. Okay. By selling an article for rupees 660. So they have given that selling price. Selling price equals to rupees 660. A man gains. A man gains 10%, which means that profit percentage. So they have given that profit percentage. So profit equals to 10%. Then find cost price of the article. So we need to find CP cost price find out channel. So then our situation is profit. If, we, if the situation is profit, then the formula is cost price equals to selling price by one plus profit by hundred. One plus profit by hundred. We have already discussed that. So formula na change out in Japan If the profit situation is profit, the situation is profit, then we get plus and profit here in the formula so selling price by selling price by 1 plus profit by 100 next what is the selling price here 660 rupees divided by 1 plus what is the profit here the profit percentage is 10 10 by 100 so we can cancel here 0 0 gets cancelled by 1 by 10 1 plus 1 by 10 and Timothana it is a mixed fraction right 1 plus 1 by 10 and I'm going to name what 10 ones are 10 11 11 by 10 so 660 by 11 by 10 so we know that denominator of the denominator is numerator so 10 will comes into the numerator 660 into 10 divided by 11 so if we cancel so 11 to cancel 11 ones are 11 six are 66 we have the zero here left over here six zero will be added to the quotient so the answer is 60 into 10, so which is equals to the cost price. Cost price of an article is rupees 600 rupees is the cost price. In this way, we will find the cost price if we have profit percentage. Okay. So just we need to apply the formula correctly. So next question, look at the next question. A shopkeeper bought a radio for rupees 570. So you know that right, bought purchased taken which means that that is the cost price so they have given that cost price cp equals to rupees 570 cp equals to rupees 570 and sold for a loss of so they have given that loss percentage so for a loss of 20 percent loss so we have sold that radio for 20 percent loss then find selling price of shopkeeper so now we need to find selling price. Now the situation is loss. So in the profit situation, in the formula we got the plus. Now the situation is loss, in the formula we get minus. So let's see here, cost. So selling price equals to CP cost price into 1 minus, 1 minus loss by 100. 1 minus loss by 100, which is equals to, CP what is the cost price here? 570 into 1 minus 20 by 100. We can cancel with the 20, right? Last percentage is 20. 20 ones are 25. Sir. 1 minus 1 by 5. 5 ones are 5. 5 minus 1, 4 by 5. So selling price equals to 570 into 4 by 5. If we cancel with the 5, 5 to cancel just yes, 5 1s are 5, 5 1s are 5, 5 1s are 5, 5 4s are 5 4s are 
five four is twenty. So which is equals to four hundred and fourteen into four. So we get that selling price of the radio. Selling price of the radio is rupees four four is sixteen. Four one is four seven. Four. So four hundred and seventy six rupees. So we are selling for four hundred and seventy rupees. So if we want to find that how much loss we get, how much profit we got, just by subtracting selling price and cost price, we get that how much profit we are gaining and how much loss we are getting. We get, we know we know by doing that simple subtraction after finding cost price only. So remember this. In these topics, in these problems, first of all, we need to find the cost price. Do whatever the things. So, a problem just to make sure. First of all, we need to find the cost price. If the cost price is missing in the question. First of all, we need to find the cost price. So, cost price find out just then. We know that what is the comparison. Comparison check along. So, next coming to that seventh question. So, what they have given us? Raju bought a watch for rupees two thousand five hundred. Bought means that cost to price. You know that right? Cost to price equals to rupees two thousand five hundred, and sold for a gain of twelve percent. Then they have sold for gain of, so which is equals to profit. Profit equals to twelve percent. So twelve percent profit ki sale jaisa na. Then what is the selling price of the watch? So watch ki selling price find out chal. So selling price equals to Now tell me that formula. In that you have to write selling price. Selling price is currently loss. Currently profit. Now you have to tell that formula. In the formula, you must know that formula. You have to give the formula. So the formula will be CP into one plus because the situation is profit. One plus profit by hundred. One plus profit by hundred. So like this, we will use the formulas. So we call it in last class chapter number. What is the formula? Selling price or cost price? Cost price equals to selling price by one plus or minus divided by hundred. For that uh, selling price, cost price into one plus or minus divided by hundred. There we will use plus for profit, minus for loss. Rate. In the place of rate, we need to replace with the profit. I think profit in replace system, loss I think loss to replace system. In the place of rate, next, what is the cost price here? Two thousand five hundred into one plus twelve by hundred. So if we do that mixture fraction, hundred one hundred 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 plus twelve one not one one two. So two thousand five hundred into one one two by hundred. Now we can cancel, right? Two zeros, two zeros gets cancelled. So twenty-five into one one two. Twenty-five into one one two. Do that multiplication. You get that selling price of the watch. Okay. By multiplying these two values, twenty-five and one one two, you get that value of selling price of watch. Next question. Look at the next question, Anna. Try to do this your own. I'm selling a Chair for rupees fifteen hundred and thirty. So what is that selling price of the chair? Is that enough? By selling a chair for rupees fifteen hundred and thirty. So they have given that selling price. What is the selling price of the chair? Fifteen hundred and thirty. By selling it for fifteen hundred and thirty, a carpenter losses fifteen percent. So loss of the carpenter is also given enough. How much loss he is getting? Fifteen percent loss he is getting. Then find original price of the chair. So what we need to find? We need to find that original price of the chair. So original price is nothing but the cost price. Whatever the initial price is there, that will be the cost price. Then. So we need to find the cost price. So cost price to find cost price, which means that CP. CP find out. Remember the formula. Is the selling price by selling price by one minus loss by hundred. One minus last by hundred. This is the formula we will use to find cost price and selling price. Now, what is the selling price here? Fifteen hundred and thirty by one minus hundred. One minus what is the last one? Fifteen by hundred. 
so here 15 will be cancelled with the 5 right 520s 53s so mixed fraction low value right now 15 mixed fraction value right 1530 divided by 20 ones are 20 20 minus 3 17 17 by 20 you know that right divide the denominator of the denominator is numerator so 20 will be sent to numerator it will be 1530 into 20 by 17 17 ones are 17 nines are 153 nana. 17 nines are 153 0 is there 0 is left out there 0 will be added to the quotient so it will be 90 into 20 so what is the answer 90 into 20 means that rupees 1800 so the original cost of that chair the original cost of the chair will be 1800 so like this we will find the cost price selling price if you have the profit percentage and last percentage just we have the two formulas two formulas but we have the four terms and a plus ni minus ni place shared on wala manaki four formulas was the total and a profit and the profit situation lo plus use system last situation lo minus use system okay so again okay sorry okay one or two times the problems in my practice and not losing that class class name is winter and a radu so we need to practice more okay next let's see some advanced questions related to this profit percentage okay at the end of the day so before going to discuss about the problem i will give brief uh, introduction about this form problems you know? so already we got the loss loss already which in the okay well if we sold for another price so we have sold a product for one price okay price ki sale jay number la loss which in so now i need to get a profit okay profit travel and for what price i need to sell for example i have this pen a pen on the Actually, I have purchased this pen for rupees 100 rupees. I have sold for 80 rupees. 80 rupees ki sale rupees ki sell jana wale I got I got 20 rupees as loss. Ledu. Ipur na ko oka 10 rupees profit achila ka sell jaya. Which means that I need to sold for 110 rupees. 110 rupees ki sell jaya. Na 80 rupees ki sell jaya. So 20 20 rupees loss us tumne. Allah ka akunda. For what price I need to sell to gain 10 rupees? 10 rupees profit travel and index sell yali 110 rupees sell yali because I have purchased this pen for 100 rupees, right? So, alandi the problem. I could already we have sold a smartphone. So, look at the quick question given that by selling a smartphone for rupees 8280, a shopkeeper losses 8 percent. So, they have given that selling price already. We have sold the smartphone for rupees. 8280 a shopkeeper losses what is the loss they have given a loss equals to 8 percent loss is 8 percent okay so now you put in at what price he need to sell the smartphone a smartphone in the sell jayali to gain 5 percent as profit so, if you have a example, you can see the cost price of 20% loss, 10% gain, 10 rupees gain. So, first of all, we need to find the cost price. Cost price is find out. Cost price is find out. So, if you have a price, sell can sell 5% gain. First of all, we need to find the cost price. So, cost to find 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 cost price. So, the situation is loss. Last situation is already to find cost price. Selling price by. 1 minus loss by 100 this is the formula so what is the selling price here 8280 by 1 minus what is loss is 8 by 100 so fourth cancel 800 fourth cancel 4 twos are 425 sir. so then what about that numerator so 820 so 8280 by 25 ones are 25 minus 2 23 23 by 25 and again numerator the denominator of the denominator is numerator so 25 will be sent to numerator then it will be 8280 into 25 by 23 by 23 so you can cancel with these values so values cancel jana na. So cancel just them. So divide 800 and 
8280 with 23 if we divide 23 3s are 23 23 4s are 92 23 3s are it will be 69 but the remainder 12 minus 9 3 8 7 minus 6 1 8 so 6 are 23 6 are 138 we got the remainder as 0 in coconut number 0 on the cavity we have to add 0 to that quotient so the answer is 360 into 25 if you do that if you multiply these two values you get that you get the value, value so how much the cost price so what is the cost price then 25 0 20 0 25 6 are 150 25 6 are 150 25 3 is at 75 75 plus 1 so 75 6 are 1 sorry 25 6 are 150 so it will be 0 0 here 15 is the 15 is the carry 25 3 is 75 75 plus 15 90 so 9000 is the cost price cost price is 9000 we got the cost price then we need to find that selling price again we need to find the selling price if we have the profit of so now we need to gain a profit of 5% not 5% profit actually like sell chain. so selling price equals to cp into 1 plus profit by 100 again we need to use this formula so two formulas you just number like now take question two formulas you just Okay, and the first of all, we need to find the cost price. Then we need to find the selling price by using this. Uh, so cost price is 9,000. 9,000 into, what is that? 1 plus profit is 5 by 100. So okay, cancel this, 5 ones are 5 twenties. So 20 ones are 20, 20 plus 1, 21. So 9,000 into, 9,000 into, 21 by 20. So if we cancel, 0, 0 gets cancelled. 2, 1, 0, 2, 4, 4, 50, sir. 450 into 21. So 21, 0, 20, 0, 21, 5, sir. 1, not 5. 5, 10, 21, 4, sir. 84, 9,450. We need to sell for 9,450 to gain 5% as profit. So rupees equals 9450 rupees. This is the answer. Then. So Kadeen yes to Nam Ante. First of all, we are finding cost price of that original cost price of that smartphone. A smartphone yak original cost price find out chase. E put a cost price in body, cost price in basis, how much value we need to increase to gain 5% as profit. Allah for Allah, yes. So next question would have the same question. So Rani, once again I will explain this question. Rahul sold a watch for rupees 2,464. So sold means that selling price. Selling price equals what is the selling price? Rupees 2,464. So thereby he losses 12%. So loss equals to 12%. So loss equals to 12%. 12%. So by selling the watch for rupees 2,464 rupees, he losses 12 percent, 12 percent loss was done. Then for what price he need, he has to sell the watch to gain 12 percent. If you do, okay, well, 2,464 rupees, sell jada mala loss, okay. If you have profit, 12 percent profit, okay, and then sell jada. So which means that first of all, we need to find the cost price. So find the cost price. Cost price equals to selling price by 1 minus loss. Because situation is loss, kada. Lost by 100. He lost the base shares. First of all, lost me selling price in base shares. First of all, we need to find the cost price. If we find the cost price, it will be 2464 by 1 minus 12 by 100. So cancel it. 4 to cancel it. 4 3 is 425 are. So if we multiply 12, 25, 25. 
minus 3 22 so 2 4 6 4 divided by 22 by 25 so again denominator of the denominator is numerator we will send the 25 to numerator it will be 24 64 into 25 by 22 now we can cancel right so division the number of 24 64 divided by 22 22 ones are 22 you get that 46 22 twos are 44 you get the 20 Correct here only we have we will have that 20 so 26 is the remainder here 22 ones are again 22 get that 44 get the now 22 twos are 44 now we get the remainder as 0 which means that 22 ones are 22 1 1 twos are 1 1 2 into 25 now multiply with 25 you get that cost of price cost of price equals to 25 twos are 50 5 25 ones are 25 plus 5 30 0 0 25 ones are 25 plus 3 2800 is the cost price of the watch so for this cost cost from by using this cost price now we need to gain 12 percent we need to find the profit percentage of 12 percent 12 percent profit of chillaga sell the alipur so selling price can call now we need to find selling price selling price equals to what is the formula cp into 1 plus so now situation is profit right so 1 plus profit by 100 so cp what is the cost price here 2800 into 1 plus what is the profit here how much profit we are getting 12 percent 12 by 100 so by using this value, value in HSE, find the selling price. So easy to find what you So 2800, so mixed fraction, right? 100 plus 12, 112 by 100. So zeros, zeros gets cancelled. It will be 28 into 112. Multiply these two values, you get that selling price. Okay, selling price for the 12% of gain. So these are the some problems to So we have the lot of problems in profit and loss. So these are the some questions, some very important questions which are asked in uh, previously in Sidney School and RMS question, RMS examinations. So please go through these problems once again, practice more, you get the more practice. If you do the more practice, you get the more understanding about these questions. So that's it guys. Tomorrow we'll see that new topic related to profit and loss. Thank you.